Now, with Labor Day weekend coming up, doctors are concerned about holiday travel, especially among those who are not vaccinated. Yeah, the Delta variant and close contact with others could spell danger. News 8's Lisa Carberg got advice from two doctors who are urging caution, and she's here now with what they told her. Lisa? Dennis and Ann, we've seen COVID spikes after other holiday weekends this year. One good thing is many people here in Connecticut are fully vaccinated, as you mentioned, so we're in a better place than the spring. Still, behavior this weekend will dictate where we will be in coming weeks and no one wants to see us go backwards. During holiday times like the upcoming Labor Day weekend, family and friends often gather in indoor settings, which allows the COVID virus to easily spread. St. Vincent's Medical Center Emergency Medicine Chair Dr. Stephen Velasquez calls this Labor Day weekend the perfect storm with the positivity rate up in Connecticut. You've got people who were vaccinated eight months ago, and so their immunity is going down. It's waning a bit. You've got the Delta variant that's come in, and obviously the Delta variant is more contagious. Travel is especially risky risky for people who have not gotten their first shot. If you look at the statistics, those who are not vaccinated, they're 16 times as likely to be hospitalized if they get COVID. Young children who are not eligible to get vaccinated yet are also at risk if traveling. The young ones luckily have done well, but we've seen an uptick in cases in the young children and we've seen an uptick in hospitalization as well. Another thing to consider about traveling to a state like Florida with a high rate of infection, hospitals are inundated with COVID cases, which could leave you without a bed should you need it while traveling. As for holiday gatherings like parties, this weekend, Yale oh, Medicine Infectious um, Disease you, Physician you Onyema Abuagu says this. You know, keep the gatherings outdoors um, if possible and try to limit the uh, size of gatherings. Doctors prefer people enjoy fun locally. Go to your local beaches, go to your parks, barbecue, you know, be smart, support your local communities here, and it's probably a good time to stay close to home. And if you do have plans to travel, Dr. Velasquez says if you are unvaccinated, wear a mask, social distance, and make wise decisions like staying outdoors, avoiding large crowds, and not unmasking indoors in places like restaurants. Lisa Carberg, News 8. Okay, thanks, Lisa. We have some